Excellency, sir, with your permission, allow me to now call the host governor, Governor of Wasingishu County, Governor Jonathan B, to make his welcoming remarks. Tum Karibishe Kwa Makofi, Honorable His Excellency Jonathan B. Karibu. Your Excellency, the President of the Republic of Kenya, Dr. William Samuel Ruto, your Excellency, um, Speaker of Senate, Amazon Kingi, Honorable Dr. Moses Wetangula, Speaker of the National Assembly, Excellency Governors, Prime Cabinet Secretary, Holmes Musalia Mudavadi, Honorable Members of Senate and National Assembly, Representatives of the Constitutional Commission and Independent Officers, leaders of Wasingishu County and the greater region, ambassadors and high commissioners, principal secretaries, members of the county assembly, all national government and county government representatives, private sector and civil society representatives and development partners, international delegates, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. I wish to extend a warm welcome to Wasingishu County, affectionately known as the Champions, where the spirit of devolution pulsates with unmatched vigor. Our county, renowned as an agricultural hub, has always been and continues to stand as a home of prominent farmers, world record breaking athletes, business, and welcoming people. It is a pleasure to have you all here. Karibuni Sana. Today, marks a significant milestone as we gather under the banner of progress, collaboration, and a shared vision at the first biannual devolution conference. This event is particularly meaningful as it returns to our county after impressive years of 94. 94 years we will have this uh, kind of conference again to, us, to come to Wasimgishu. I am honored to stand before this as, as esteemed assembly hosting the banner of unity and progress that resonates with all of us. Let us make a moment to acknowledge transformative power of devolution and extend my appreciation to His Excellency President Dr. William Samuel Ruto for his unwavering dedication to this cause. Devolution is more than a mere political or administrative concept. It embodies the very spirit of our nation. It, it encapsulates and the principles of democracy, inclusivity, and grassroots governance that form the bedrock of our national growth and development. This conference stands as a testament to the strides we have made in nurturing the principles and our collective commitment to steer Kenya towards greater prosperity through the devolution of power and resources. Ladies and gentlemen, education, infrastructure, health, and agriculture are the cornerstones on which our national future rests. In Wasingishu County, we have witnessed these sectors flourish under the nurturing empress of devolution. A prime example is the school feeding program for early childhood education development, uh, ECDs, locally known as Maziwa Yakoti Moja, which has led to remarkable increase in pupil enrollment and exemplified by 40% growth in our schools within Capsarate sub-county. Our commitment to education has yielded empowered minds and skilled workforce. We have recently confirmed our ECD teachers on permanent and pensionable terms, which has boosted their morale. Ladies and gentlemen, our ambition extends further under the visionary guidance of His Excellency the President. The establishment of county aggregation industrial parks and export processing zones holds the promise of transforming employment and opportunities for our youth and attracting vital investments. Substantial progress 
has made with 135 acre piece of land he a marked for development. As we engage with prospective investors, we eagerly anticipate the manifold benefits these endeavors will bring to our county. Our infrastructure projects have redefined connectivity and accessibility. Well-maintained roads and modern transportation networks have turned Wasingishu County into an economic hub within the wider North Rift region. Through these investments in connectivity, we are fostering regional integration, economic growth, and efficient movement of people, goods, services, and ideas. Ladies and gentlemen, medical tourism has been a cornerstone of our county. We take pride not only in having top-notch hospitals, but also in innovative technology-backed healthcare systems. Enhancing maternal and child health services and improving disease prevention and treatment remain vital pillars in our Ngusokumi Manifesto, which is now implemented as a third county integration development plan. Our county's fertile lands have consistently yielded abundant harvests, solidifying was in Gishu County as the nation's bread basket. Timely provision of essential farm inputs has ignited optimism among our farmers. This year, our fields are abundant with maize harvest and the sight of farmers proudly displaying their produce in photographs exemplifies the positive change fostered under the Kenya Kwanzaa administration. In the midst of our devolution accomplishments, I urge all of us to center our discourse on fundamental matter, bolstering service delivery through performance management. Devolution empowers our people ensures equitable resources, uh, resource distribution, and improves lives. To uphold this noble cause, we must not merely inspire for service excellence, but it is the guiding principle for our governance architecture. Transformative service delivery as deformed entities requires proactive performance management underpinned by transparency, which propels us towards effective governance. Ladies and gentlemen, our achievements span beyond sectors. Was in Gishu County has flourished as an ideal place to work, live, invest, and explore. A secure environment, conducive business climate, and rich cultural tapestry converge to create an eco ecosystem that welcomes us all. Our strides in infrastructure, education, health, sports, and agriculture not only enhances citizens' quality, of life, but also beyond investors and tourists to discover the myriad opportunities in our county. And as we gather for this conference, let us remember that the spirit of devolution burns within each of us. It is collective journey towards realizing our forefathers' dreams and securing a brighter future for generations to come. Let's engage in meaningful discussion, share knowledge, and chart a course that fortifies our nation's fabric. To you, Your Excellency, esteemed guest, I extend heartfelt gratitude for gracing us with your presence. Together, let's continue to foster the spirit of devolution, ensuring that Kenyan's path towards progress and pro prosperity remains unstoppable. Thank you, and may, his may this conference resonate as a resounding success. Thank you, Asante Nisana. Eliseme Karibuni Tena was in Gishu. This is a place. Uh, that we prepared for you as our guest. As you move around and see the beauty of this county, you can also see the potential that you can, uh, the in of investment that we have in our region. We pride ourselves for our key athletes who have given us a good name. Our brand is the County of Champions. And I want to say Karibuni Sana to the County of Champions, Asanteni Namungu Awabariki. Before I forget, we also have some nightlife here. We have more nightlife than daylife. So I want to say when you move around, just feel good, you are secure. Asanteni Namungu Awabariki. Thank you very much, Your Excellency Jonathan B. Next, Your Excellency, I would like to call upon 